In this pointwise demonstration, I'll be showing you how to generate a viscous volume mesh consisting of a prismatic boundary layer using extrusion tools that are available in pointwise. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to march a prism layer off the watertight unstructured surface mesh into the volume in order to generate a boundary layer. The next thing I'll do is populate the remaining volume with isotropic tetrahedra, completing the volume mesh. So the first thing I'll do is select the surface mesh, go to create extrude normal, set up my boundary layer parameters and run the extrusion. Once the extrusion has completed you can now see that I have a layer of prism elements. The next step is to populate the remaining volume with isotropic tetrahedra. Now that the remaining volume has been populated with isotropic tetrahedra we can select the volume mesh, take a section cut and look inside. So as you can see I now have a boundary layer consisting of prism elements and an interior consisting of isotropic tetrahedra. One thing to note is that during the extrusion process quality criteria are continuously checked. If there happens to be a violation in quality criteria the propagating prism layer will stop. This tends to happen in sharp corners where extruding prisms tend to collide and create cells that violate quality criteria such as this internal corner here.